All right, here's the new mount. It is quite literally just a sort of a U shape of aluminium, which is uh, shaped and then clamped by a hose clamps top and bottom onto the bars. The foam padding in here is sort of relatively solid padding, and I think that's where I've made my mistake uh, so far. In that um, it's nice and solidly connected to the bars now, so we don't get that kind of general sort of camera shake that I was getting when it was on the tripod mounted on the, the bars up here. The problem now is that uh, the vibration from the engine comes through so fast and quick through the bars that it shakes the camera very sort of uh, quite violently, but very, very small vibration. Um, so it um, makes the video look blurry, but the problem really is the fact that the camera can't handle the vibration so it um, keeps switching itself off, like safety mode or whatever, as well sometimes it does sort of rewrite errors to the SD card. So what I'm starting to do is play around with the foam which is down the floor there, like much, much softer, fluffier sort of foam. So hopefully um, I'll pack it in here, hopefully it'll work. It's getting quite stormy outside. Cool. Um, so yeah, hopefully the uh, extra foam in there will do the difference. I may have to take this blue stuff out um, in an effort to make it uh, a little bit less vibration coming through the bar. I'll put some thinner, same, uh, some, some of the same foam, but thinner underneath the hose clamps. But uh, didn't really seem to do much. So don't know. We'll have to see. So basically, what I do is I slot the camera in here under this um, wing nut here. Put the camera in, um, I can adjust the angle sort of up and down, and then clamp it in nice and tight, and it just does not move. So once we get the vibration thing sorted out, it will be, uh, hopefully, really nice. Yeah, oh well, work in progress, we'll see.